engineers at the Massachusetts Institute of Technology, MIT, and Shanghai Jiao Tong University created an inflatable robotic prosthetic hand. This breakthrough technology is a neuroprosthetic, meaning it picks up on residual muscle signals to perform the intended motions. Things like pouring a carton of milk or zipping a suitcase shut are made possible with this mind-controlled hand. Typically, neuroprosthetic limbs are heavy and pricey. The inflatable hand, however, is soft, light, and relatively affordable. Amputees can perform four different grip types while wearing the inflatable hand, from pinching to cupping the palm. The hand is made from elastomer eco flex fingers attached to a 3D printed palm. The user wears a small pump and valves at the waist to position the fingers as desired. Woodworker Evie B has created the electrically wooden e-bike one-of-a-kind vehicle that takes inspiration from old-school scrambler motorcycles, marrying their unique look with wood-based sustainable design. Stunningly handcrafted, the bike's body is made from layers of sustainably sourced poplar ply and birchwood, which be combined to form a highly complex interwoven pattern. Though several elements of the bike are handcrafted, its design was created using 3D computer graphics software. Once processed by the software, the frame of electrically wooden e-bike was milled on a CNC machine while its stainless steel parts were shaped by a powerful plasma cutter. In terms of power, the bike houses a 26 Smart Pi front wheel motor and a 36 125 battery, allowing it to reach speeds of up to 28 mph. Hailed as the world's first 3D light field tablet, the 3D Loom Pad by Layer incurs images into 3D projections that are visible with the naked eye. Winning innovation recognition at CS 2021, this 10.8-inch Android tablet has impressed some of the world's top app developers due to its innovative and patented holographic technology. All users have to do is tap a button to transform 2D images and videos into 3D objects. What makes this technology so groundbreaking is that it does not require 3D-specific images, videos, or apps to work its magic. For the first time, we are delivering a virtually infinite amount of 3D content to consumers in a familiar mobile form factor and with zero compromise on the 2D experience, explains David Fattel, Layer's co-founder and CEO. With the release of the 3D Loom Pad and its universal 3D tech, Layer solidifies itself as a leading innovator in the space of mobile device design.
Like in 2050, world in 2050, the world will be done.